Guys, that monkey gamer back here for another video. Guys, today what we'll be doing is actually trying to snipe these positional hero collectibles or sign up collectibles players out of these sets, guys. So if you are excited for this video, make sure you slap that like button and subscribe to the channel if you are new. So going through right away, guys. Now that all these players actually have value, it should be quite interesting when you're opening up pro packs or you're doing solo challenges because a lot of stuff actually has gained a lot of value. So it's kind of nice now because when you pull packs it's not just like okay well I just pulled an 80 overall who cares now you could have an 84 overall like right here and he goes for about 2k so he's actually going up in price and you know those double gold packs where you get you know double gold now you actually have double golds that go for 63k because why the heck not right <laughs> Like, what, what, why not, right? So, for some reason, guys, they decided to make 74 overalls very, very, um, you know, and this set is going to be very, very expensive. So, it's going to be very annoying to do, and I would not recommend doing these sets. But what you can do is if you do have anything in your binder, make sure you sell everything right now. And my whole entire point is, guys, sell them before the all these prices come down in value. Because eventually everything's gonna crash in value um you know these players are not gonna stay at whatever price they're going for right now forever they're gonna come down in value same thing with elite badges make sure you sell your elite badges actually they have come down in value too so everything's gonna crash in value eventually because again a 97 overall right end is not gonna be a crazy crazy card or oh, sorry, a crazy value because there's so many good left ends, right ends in the game that his stats are not going to reckon him being this great of a card. So make sure right now, guys, go through your binders, go through your farm accounts, sell every gold you have in those accounts, get rid of them, and keep your silvers. We have Silver Meadow Master coming out sometime soon. Make sure to keep your silvers and get rid of those golds. Um... But actually, to be honest, we can't really snipe any of these cards because there's no, like, guaranteed of what's actually going for a lot. So what we're going to actually be doing is going back to Campus Hero and trying to get some more snipes on these cards. Because these collectibles are pretty OP, to be honest, out on how, you know, low people put these up for and how easy you can snipe these. So definitely, guys, if you want a pretty easy sniping technique... Just go to Campus Heroes and go through them and try to um, get some good snipes here because this is something that is surprisingly very easy. If you saw my last video when I tried to snipe these, I was getting a good snipe like every couple minutes, which, you know, whenever you're sniping, you usually don't get that, those good um, kind of snipes every couple minutes. You don't usually get like a 2 or 3k snipe, so very, very nice to get those kind of snipes and... I don't know if we're going to have as good a luck of as we did before right now because obviously um, I didn't make a video about it. So a lot of more people are going to be looking at these sets and trying to get some good snipes from them. But actually right there, 5,800 to 5,100, that's uh, not that bad of a snipe right there. Of course, I'm not going to go for that. It's only like 200 coins. But these kind of collectible snipes usually those amounts is what you actually want to go for you want to go for the lower amounts you don't want to go for the higher amounts because um most likely you're not gonna get many higher amounts so if you can take what you can get at the lower amounts you will find a lot of um you will have a lot of success whenever trying to go through these sets so that's something to look at whenever you're going through any sets so pretty much this set right here um it doesn't look like it's fire right now. It's, you know, maybe just a long time to snipe those. This set could be fire. This set is not really fire at all. Um, it doesn't want to give you too many crazy collectibles. Oh, sorry, crazy snipes. Positional heroes. I could see how this could be crazy, especially if you can, you know, go through and get one of those rare gold cards that go for like 63k. Someone puts it up for like 750 coins. You can definitely get some good snipes. Ultimate Legends. I already went over Ultimate Legends and why they're very, very good to snipe. But that's definitely something to uh, look at, guys, is go through these sets for positional heroes and look at the rare golds and try to see if someone will put it up for 750 coins. 
And for example, which one was it? Oh crap, it's the free agent version, right? Yeah, it was, I think this card. So just go through and see, okay, he's up right now 63k. Then go through and keep going through and trying to get those snipes. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Hey guys, if you did enjoy this video and you would like to support me even more, definitely you can do so by going down below in the description and uh, going and joining the GOAT list. Now the GOAT list is a list of people where I do monthly giveaways for Xbox One and PS4 mutt cards. Also, it's just a list of people if I ever need, you know, you get direct contact with me. I can talk, you can talk to me whenever you would like to. Um, and if I ever need to do a connected franchise or anything like that, or if I'm doing wager matches, or if I, you know, want someone to play someone for a video, um, I'm going to be looking at the GOAT list to actually choose those people to play. Also, you will be added into every one of my descriptions for joining the GOAT list. And now the new award is you will be added into every one of my videos, as you can see on your screen right now. Nate Dog, Ryan the Snatcher, and Timothy are currently members of the GOAT list. So guys, if you want to join them and be a member of the GOAT list for awesome giveaways, and a lot of us awesome awards definitely do so down below in the description i'll see you guys in the next one peace out